If you want to make it today, you have to do it on your own. And in Australia, the best way to do that is a web series. But it has to go viral. And what's more infectious than Trump? Huh? Because I look a bit like him, Greg asked me to imitate Trump. Michael has this idea. It's great. Shane plays Trump and I play the security guard who holds the case with the nuclear codes. Basically, every time some country or someone insults Trump, the moron gets angry and wants to nuke them. And so he asks Greg for the case. Are you still listening, Meryl? Because I got a new role for you, okay? It's a bigly, it's huge. It's called Watch the Overrated Woman Run. Start running, Meryl. Give me the case. What? Uh, then, in order to save the world, Greg has to come up with novel ways to stop Trump pressing the button. What case? What do you mean, what case? That case. This case? This ain't the case. This is my lunch. To make it even funnier, I'm his cousin. Trump has given the job of holding the nuclear codes to his cousin. I have other cousins, okay? I have lots and lots of cousins. Anyway, eventually Greg is forced to hand over the case and the comedy becomes a thriller. Now that's a button. But then just as he's about to press the button, Shane notices something else. As a safeguard, Greg has put other things in the case to distract Trump. And now, the end is near. And while he's preoccupied, I pull the case away and save the world. And we face the final curtain. It's, uh, it's funny. Well, it was going to be funny until... Cut. Cut. What are you doing? This is hilarious. He's going to kill us all. Have we cut yet? Hang on, hang on, hang on. What's, your, what's, what's, your, what's your problem, man? What is the problem? It's just, I don't think he'd do this. Do what? Sing or, or press the button? Currently, it's like the entire artistic community just determined to make him look like an idiot. He is an idiot. What they're actually doing is using him to get famous. They don't care about him or the world. All they care about is hits. It, uh... It seems that Shane, our Trump impersonator, has come to uh, like Trump. No, no, I wouldn't say like. It's just that I've been researching the man. I've been watching the speeches and, uh, you know, sometimes when he talks, he makes sense. He actually makes sense. You know, Michael could write skits that are positive, that celebrate uh, some of the, the, the amazing things that the man's done. We need to replace Trump. No, 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 no. He'll be fine. We just, we just have to be patient with him. Yeah, just, just, just be gentle. Just do the fucking lines. I have principles. What principles? What principles? You're a fucking actor. Actors have principles. Look at De Niro. 
But De Niro can afford to have principles. He has two Oscars and he treats women with respect. I have principles. Well, if you get a million hits, you'll also get paid. Money isn't everything. What? Two million hits and we might get on Ellen. Ellen. Give me the keys. And the home of the free.